the 16th congregation of the Evangelical Presbyterian College of Education saw the graduation of 195 pioneering students of the Bachelor of Education program. Ten of the graduates were awarded first class, 148 had second class upper, while 37 had second class lower. The year recorded no third class and pass. The college principal, Dr. Dixon Chair, said they achieved such a great feat while grappling with infrastructural deficits. The college lacks an auditorium, administration block, staff accommodation, lecture halls, among others. Reverend Chairman, while we celebrate our achievements, it is also important to acknowledge the challenges that we face as a college that needs, that needs urgent attention. Some of these are as follows. Lack of auditorium. The stalled 300 capacity hostel project. The abandoned get fund project for the female students. We are at this moment once again appealing to government. The Director General of the National Council for Curriculum Assessment, Professor Yaya Jakajie, chronicled how Ghana missed out on the first, second, and third industrial revolutions and underscored the need for a paradigm shift. Breaking the status quo begins with rethinking the, the very foundations of teacher education. We must move beyond the traditional lecture halls and embrace new and innovative approaches that reflect the realities of today's classroom. Teacher education programs must incorporate technology, not as afterthoughts, but as a core component of the curriculum prospect. <laughs> curriculum prospect. Curriculum. Tegbe Ajanye of Ziavi entreated the graduates to take their destiny into their hands. Fred Kwame Asai, join us. I'm a good